There's two ways that I cut mango. I get a paring knife, slice one side off, and then I make like the little cubes inside the peel so that it's way easier to eat. Slice it one way, slice it the other way, right next to each other, and you get your cubes. The other way you can do is slice it, so you peel the mango, and then you take a flat side, slide it down, and cut it. Turn, cut, turn, cut. That's the safest way that I can do it. And then I try to get as close as I can to the pit so that I can get additional slices off the mango so that it's easier to eat. You can eat it however you want. You don't even really have to peel it, but it just makes it easier to eat and to cut and use in dishes. Next, we're going to cut pineapple. Cut off the top and the bottom and then cut off the sides just past the green peel. Make sure you get all the brown prickly parts off too because you don't want to eat that. Then cut the middle. Cut the middle of those pieces till you get quarters. And then those quarter pieces, you're going to cut off the pit at an angle downwards towards the cutting board to remove the peel completely and slice into slices. Lastly is the avocado. You're going to cut from the top until you hit the pit and then go all the way around the pit. Turn and pop it open. That's it. You can slice it through the peel. Then use the heel of your bigger knife turn and twist and you'll get the core out you can use a spoon to get out the slices evenly or you can dice them up and use a spoon again to get out dices that's easier to use in your dishes and that's it guys